Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today, Sam and I are already up and out. Okay, it's 12.07. And today, the craziest thing happened. I was relaxing. Sophie came downstairs. I was reading a book. I found this really good book. Sometimes, like, I feel like God led me to this book and wanted me to read it. And one day on my channel, I hope to tell you guys how I figure out what God wants you to do and then it makes life so much easier. Um, anyways, so I was reading a book and Sophie came downstairs and she said, oh, you never relax. And I was like, I know, this is the best thing ever. It was amazing. But then Sam was like, come on, let's go shopping. And I'm like, never one to refuse shopping. So we are headed into town to do a little bit of shopping. But I wanted to tell you guys that you guys, our mares are all, whoever thought I'd say we had mares. We have three mares, holy heck. Anyways, they're all happy. Um, Jennifer Lehman and Mel Bowell, you guys convinced me to leave them out in the field. So our horses, thank you. You guys and a few others. I seriously was panicking about Stella's weight. Our farrier was there. He was feeling her crest and saying, you know, she doesn't look too bad, but definitely stay on top of it. I, um, he told me that the same thing was happening to his mare, that she's re freshly released out into a big field now that the snow is there. She's getting older, this his mare, and he has a Palomino mare that, that he got when he was 12. And, um, actually maybe he was younger. He got this pony anyway, his parents bought it for him. And, um, he said, you know, he's not feeding her anymore, he, he, she's, but she's starting to get bigger and bigger. So definitely a worry. But, so we just decided we're gonna just keep trying because they do like the field, but I think the reason that they like the field is because there's grass under the snow. So what we did was we decreased the amount of hay that we feed them by a lot, and we're just gonna go as we see. Like, they tell us when they're hungry, they tell us when they need more, and so we're just gonna play it by ear for another few days, see how it goes, see if we can get Stella back on track. Even the minis have gained weight. It's crazy, but anyway, Welcome to today's video. I can't wait to see what's gonna happen today because as of this moment, I got nothing planned for you guys. Sometimes it's when you have nothing planned that God is finally able to infuse something great into your life. So I'm excited to see what God has planned for us today. What is it? Hot sauce. Swift burn hot sauce. It looks like dynamite. It looks like dynamite? You guys might not know. One of our kids is addicted to hot sauce. And I saw on another video that um, you can buy advent calendars with hot sauce, Sam. Oh, cool. And jam. And next year, we're all gonna get advent calendars and all of us are gonna get ones geared specifically to us. I am finishing up the last minute stuff I needed for Christmas, like a little bit of chocolate, a couple of more gift bit boxes. I'm in the last bit, you guys. The last tiny bit of shopping, I'm almost done. Some of you guys have been asking about the advent calendar, like what the heck is happening with them? What'd you get today? A bowl, isn't it adorable? And what did you get yesterday? A fence. <laughs> isn't that crazy? They also got a bucket. Two more pieces of fencing. Apples. A lovely golden retriever. Two more pieces of fencing. And, and a mare. And a mare. So that's what they've gotten so far. I'm excited to see. Do you get any more horses or is it just the two? One more. Oh, one more horse. I bet you it's on Christmas Eve. Thanks. We're headed down to the horse barn. One thing I struggle with is time for friends. Time for friends, time for other family. <laughs> I struggle with time. That's like my big thing. It's time. I never have enough. So um, today we're gonna do a separation. I am gonna go to Shayla's house and show her how to edit so that she can make more content for you guys. If you guys don't know, our friend Shayla has a channel and over Christmas we're gonna hopefully make some videos with her and even Kaylee at the bar doing fun things with our horses. So I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna spend this time to help her so that she can do what she needs to do because that's what it's all about in this world is helping one another and loving one another so even though sometimes it's hard to find the time finding the time is what's most important so i'm going to do that and the girls are going to go with sam and take hay to the barn if you guys don't know some of you guys don't know our geldings are at our lesson barn because it makes it easier for us to ride them um because they have a bigger indoor we bring our own food and our own hay and the girls are going to go and just visit with them for a few minutes. We will be back to ride them tomorrow in uh, group lessons. Um, so today we're just going to go and break up the day for them because they're on outdoor board there. It's the only kind of board they really have. So 
I like to go at least once a day, at least five days a week and try and get them in and make sure that they know that we still love them because it's been hard on us to, to take them there. So we are at the barn. Hi. And we're getting our horses, which are there, who are sharing out of the same feeder right now. Hey, feeder. And don't mind the dog leash. My mom didn't bring up my lead rope. So yeah, they have made friends with the mares. So we just brought the horses inside. We put them in stalls. Um, we are going to huff pick them and maybe take off their blankets so that they can run around in their end. So now that we caught our horses, we are we are hoof picking them and then we're gonna put them in the arena and let them run around. Um, what did he do? <coughs> Sophia's going to attempt to do Finn's back feet. Look at how good he is though when he picks them up. How hard is that? How hard is that? Good boy. All right, so they got their hay ready for dinner. Problem is, Storm likes to kick out his hay all the time. So he leaves all his hay on the ground all the time. So I'm gonna put it in there and hopefully, hopefully he doesn't knock it out. So we're here at the barn just to spend a little bit of time with the horses. I had to bring a load of hay so every week. I pretty much have to bring hay to the barn because we provide our own hay. So I don't know if the lawyer mentioned, but we bring our own hay every week. That way they're not eating off a round bale and eating the whole time and we watch their diet. Keep their diet and maintain their eating habits. So we're teaching Finn how to pick up his feet and be good about it. Nope, not that time. Put it down and try again. No, not that time, Finny. Try again. Need to do it. Nice. Good boy. Hey, thank you. That was a foot. Other foot. He did it. Boy, that was nice and smooth. So you're working on picking up his feet? Yes. Yeah. Normally he picks up his foot and he's like, hey, you need to hold my foot up. Like you need to Yeah, me. he's crazy with his back feet. But so whenever he sees these treats, he's like, okay, I'll be good. Ben boy, I got nothing for you. You got a hard to I got nothing for you, Ben. Got, got nothing for you. Having some little bit of recreation time.
And Finn is just following around Sophia. Yeah. I'm pinning his ears. I'm pinning his ears at you? Why? Because I have food. Oh. It's precious. So he's pinning his ears because you have food. Uh-huh. You never noticed before? Don't know why he would pin his ears. There he goes. Spinning his ears might mean something different, though. Let's see him kiss on his own. Let's see your boy kiss, so. Bowing. Bow. Bow. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you tomorrow. Did Storm get very mad that Finn was going to the water first? No. Hmm. You sad? Will you see them tomorrow? No, I'm not sad. No? We're seeing them tomorrow That's night. That's right. Bring his lead rope, because what did you get? What did you bring? Mom brought. I'll tell you a story. We were in a rush yesterday, and and Laura. I was up at the house grabbing food and putting water in the car for us. And Storm had his farrier, and um, his lead rope was connected to Willow's halter, but on her stall door. So this is where my mom sits. This is where my lead rope was, right here, this far yeah. away from her. And then she literally took a dog leash because it was hanging up behind her. Yeah, so we got a dog leash. We still didn't bring the lead rope that we were supposed to bring. Because we're so smart. But anyways, we'll bring it tomorrow. Hopefully we remember. Right? Bring it up from the barn tonight though. Yeah, all right. Yeah, okay, let's go. Oh, you guys, I'm walking to the barn and the pitch black. I can't see anything. I'm terrified I'm going to fall. Hello, Hendrix! Fancy meeting you here! Are you coming for food? This is the first time I've been in the barn all day. Makes me nervous, Sophie, out there all by herself. They're out there calling her. Come on, Stella! It's pitch black, nobody can see anything. We need to get some lights. Whew, we were not expecting to be this late. So uh, today's the first day that we put the girls in the field. It's a, uh, with less hay. It's supposed to rain for the next two days, which sucks because all the snow is gonna disappear and then there's gonna be like grass. So, um, so I think the girls are only gonna get to go out if, if the conditions are right. I feel like I put so much blood, sweat, 
tears, worry, stress, into getting Stella healthy, all of the things to do with her feet after we went on our vacation, her injecting her hawk, like there's just so many things that we did to make her, there's just so many things we did to make her well. I don't want to risk it, you guys. See, all you perfectionists out there, look away. We may be doing something wrong here. They just follow Sophie. Gracie's cutting off Stella. Gracie's, I think Gracie's one of my favorite ponies. Oh, come on, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Hey, Gracie. Uh oh. Oh, she took off. Oh, what? She did not take off. Come on, just go to the barn. So follow. Oh, come on. Don't go to the road. Don't go to the road. Is she going? Sophie, just bring her. The driveway, so that sucks. That actually sucks. All right, Gracie will not leave the mom. Oh, okay, put Gracie, put Willis Lincoln Gracie on her. Was cutting me off, though. <laughs> I know she needs some oh, work. Oh, Gracie work. needs some work.